All right, here we are at 28747 Xenon Way here in Village Walk of Anita Springs. This is the Carrington model. Okay, this one's a little bit different. This is a Pulte home. Uh, same, obviously, development. We're still in Village Walk of Anita Springs, but this is the new developer. Okay, DeVosta did everything else. Pulte came in around 2009, 2010 and started building new units. So these floor plans are a little bit different. Okay, um, it's turnkey furnished. Everything you see will stay. It's priced at 268 uh 900 so right or right at that you know 269 270 mark okay immediately to my right is a double door entry for the den slash third bedroom okay it does have a closet so it counts as a, as a bedroom uh plantation shutters throughout which is nice um it's decorated pretty nicely throughout you know pretty neutral but everything's in good shape okay kitchen's kind of right in the middle of the place granite countertop nice cabinets plenty of storage uh stainless steel appliances so uh, kitchen's pretty good. Further down the right, down the guest wing, is your laundry room, washer dryer, laundry tub. That door leads out to the garage. Okay, all pretty standard there. Here's your guest bath, a uh, little vanity. Stand up shower, pretty standard. Here's your third bedroom, second bedroom, I guess, your main guest bedroom, I guess, if you want to call it that. Again, plantation shutters, um, you know, futon in here, recliner chair. You know, you got some pictures, flat screen TV. You got a walk-in closet in here, which is nice. More more closet space you can get down here, the better. Um, nice dining room table, tile floors are a nice color, all neutral. Um, we'll walk on back. Nice couches, nice one big couch, I guess, big L-shaped couch. Um, entertainment unit, okay. Built in 2010, again, so it's quite a bit newer than the other ones that we've seen, all built in 2005, 2006. Nice little lake view, I'll show you out here, kind of your exposure, it's real private out here. Um, there's some people across the lake, but you know, you're, both people are blocked by trees, so there's really nothing to worry about that. No one really over here on this side, and over here, got a wall on this side, so I mean, it's pretty peaceful out here. Um, your exposure again is to the east, which is kind of what you were looking for. Um, so that's nice. Um, let's see. Here's your master bedroom, another flat screen TV. You know, all the furnishings are pretty nice. It all depends on your taste, whether or not, you know, you like it. Raised countertops, dual sinks, um, stand up shower over here. There's your water closet, towel racks. And then closet over here to my right. Bada bing, bada boom. And then another walk-in closet. So it's got a lot of storage space. It's got an extra bedroom as compared to the Capri models. Uh, it's a little bit newer as compared to the Capri models. Um, higher priced, obviously, because it's turnkey furnished. Um, listed about $35,000 more than my other one. So, I mean... You know, you could argue that if you went to furnish a place like this when it was empty, um, you could spend probably 15, 20 grand furnishing it. You know, maybe a little bit more depending on how high end you wanted to go. Um, so, I mean, there's definitely value there. It's only been on the market two days. So that's going to be a real difficult time. If you like this place, as far as negotiations go, you're going to have to pay upwards of 260 for this because I don't think they're coming down below that. Um, when it's on the market, you know, the first 10, 15, 20 days, it's hard to get somebody to negotiate down even $5,000 sometimes. So that's it. That's my story. Um, it's a nice unit. They get a lot of showings. So let me know what you think.